good day. And welcome to Jordan Swim with a company called Carlton Provisions. You're going to be uh, moving into the uh, Legacy Hall in Plano, which is coming up in October. You, you're a little bit delayed. You're going to be starting uh, in, in January. Yes, Carlton Provisions is in a 40-foot shipping container um, in the box garden. They're calling welcome. it the box garden because it's a bunch of boxes it out is. there. It is. It's shipping containers stacked on top of each other. You're not claustrophobic, are you? I hope not. <laughs> <laughs> we'll find I out. I love that idea. Yeah, so the leg of the hall is going to open and then you guys will follow. Yes. And, uh, and what can people expect? People can expect um, many different artisan and chef uh, restaurants and concepts, uh, great craft bars, a craft brewery, and of course today we're talking about Texas barbecue. That we are. You've got, brought some barbecue with you. We're also yes. making uh, poblano creamed corn. Absolutely. We've okay. got, um, I got some butter melted here and then we're going to have, um, I've got a little onion that we diced up okay. and then we're going to basically build a roux in this. Now a roux is equal parts fat and flour. And so you let that form, the butter melts, the onions got nice and translucent. Mm -hmm. And then what I'm gonna do is that this roux will form as we add in the flour. This is the thickening agent for the corn. Okay. I'm gonna let that cook, thicken up. The next thing we wanna do is we wanna add in, I've got some frozen corn as well as some fresh corn. Um, okay. What happens is Why? <laughs> you, get, you get two different textures. The frozen really? corn has been blanched. It's also easy, um, you don't have to shuck all the corn. Okay. And then the fresh corn um, is great because it's generally a Texas product. Huh. Uh, so right. then you mix it up. You, you, get, you get the flavor of the fresh, but with a little bit less flavor yes. too. Yes, and the body. So what happens is you stir this in. I'm gonna crank our heat up just a little bit. This begins to form. That thickening agent is there. I add in my corn. Okay. The next step I'm gonna add in is a little bit of half and half. Okay. This half and half forms, it's kind of like a, a bechamel, which yeah. is, a, is a thickening cream mm. sauce. Right. And then of course what we wanna do is we've got two different types of peppers to let simmer. Okay. I have roasted jalapenos and I have roasted poblanos. Oh. Again, the same way with the corn, is you get double, um, double textures, also two different levels of heat. And then the last thing we're gonna do here yeah. is we're gonna add in a touch of Monterey Jack cheese. Ooh. We let that melt. And what I have here is I've got you just a sample yeah, look at this. for this the poblano cream corn. That. Beautiful. That looks great. That so about how long delicious. does it take to cook all this up? Generally, once you have everything chopped, diced, and ready, it takes about 15 minutes for it to come together, and then I'll let it cook another 10 minutes just for all the flavors to come. Okay, Perfect. and we should talk about the meat, too, Absolutely. because you guys are talking about some real high-quality premium meats. Yes, yeah, so we have prime barbecue. Um, this is a prime brisket, and we've smoked it for 12 hours. Mm. And it's, um, it's over, uh, we use hickory and oak. And then we've got some great Hill Country sausage. I'm gonna slice this up. This is from Elgin, Texas, from a small producer. This is a jalapeno cheddar sausage. Oh. And then we have <laughs> seaboard ribs. These are our five hour ribs, finished with a little glaze. And of course, you have to have two different sauces. Of course. We have our Carlton not? Provisions house sauce, okay. and then we also have our Low Country sauce. How what is, what outstanding. Is Low Country sauce? Low Country is the vinegar East okay. Coast sauce. A little and, different. And we think this is going to be a great product at Legacy Hall, and okay. also a great catered product. We'll put a link to the recipe and Carlton Provisions on our website, fox4news.com. Well,